Let's kick it. Many, many moons ago that I was contacted to kind of uh, put together these ASCO updates in Boise, kind of you're always, it's a kind of, you know, an intimidated experience. You don't know you're planning, but it's like planning a party. So you don't know how, you know, this is going to, to evolve, but I think it has been very, very nicely embraced uh, so far. Uh, quite a few community physicians practicing here in Boise have embraced that. And uh, I got a few thank yous. Thank yous for coming out here in Boise to have these uh, ASCO updates. Um, because uh, for many community physicians attending the real ASCO conference, it's an overwhelming experience. Uh, it's very, uh, I don't think that the ASCO by itself is geared towards the community physicians. And it is those outreach activities that will actually get uh, to the community physicians, the, the key points, the key updates, the practice changing updates. So yes, I think it has been very nicely embraced by the community physicians and I feel very, very uh, relieved and enthusiastic that this has been the case actually. So yeah, I'm focused more in breast cancer, but I think um, I'm actually the perfect judge right now since my I have gotten detached from all the other, you know, the hematologic updates, the G, uh, gastrointestinal updates, g gender urinary updates for the last decade. They're actually pretty good. They, they, uh, the, all the speakers provide an overview of how the field is evolving in their respective uh, uh, cancer sites. And um, so it's a very good, uh, they have a very good introduction and then they provide the nitty gritty kind of, they slowly um, provide the updates and uh, the latest and greatest in their own respective fields. It's um, unfortunately kind of, you know, the, the field is evolving so fast. Well, unfortunately for us, but fortunately for our patients, uh, it's evolving very, very fast. So uh, keeping pace with all the developments is, 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 is a challenge. And it is a reflection of the very, uh, um, accelerated pace of uh, evolution of um, uh, the therapeutic landscape that um, there is a great demand to bring those developments to the community physicians and keep them keep them abreast with the latest developments. I can still remember the very first event that was organized in Salt Lake City and it was the Precision Oncology. Um, really, uh, it was probably two years ago and uh, this is when I got um, uh, my first encounter, my first interaction with the Vinatara Foundation uh, and after that I got invited to the San Antonio updates over in uh, Seattle uh, and they stayed, you know, slowly and steadily I got more and more involved so well it is a cause that I embrace and, um, and uh, as I've said over the years my involvement has gotten, you know, escalated and uh, it has been a great experience, a very gratifying experience actually. That's great, that's great to hear. Thank you so much. Thank great, you thank you. Down.